Okay, YouTube, we're at the uh, secret testing facility of the Joe Saljo One um, YouTube channel. We're testing this Trebuchet alias catapult to see how far it throws. He has a tape measure laid out there. So let me get in a good spot here. Zoom in a little. Go ahead. Oh, it hit the electric line. <laughs> These freaking kids will drive you crazy. Not bad though. From from this telephone pole here to that telephone pole down there is 211 feet. I know that because I ta I uh, fixed train. Uh, total stations and when I do that I need to have uh, exact measurements of stuff. Okay so we're down range now. We are at 188 feet. Yeah. And he said that that's the best one he got so far so let's see what happens. Uh, it's been raining all weekend. I can't pick up leaves in the rain. All right. That's that's only about 150. That hit right there by the end of the blueberry bushes. This end. Somewhere right there. 132 feet. Okay, well why don't you take that pin out? And try the other one again and see how that works. Alright, so we've got a little bit of a bit of a crosswind here. A hundred and ten. Wow, that did go further. 124. I'm thinking maybe uh, we got to put a little bit better bend on that hook, on yeah. that pin. These are those pins that we were talking about there. Apparently the angle that you have that on, and it does, if if we put the pin on here, we're getting around 120 feet. If we, with this one, we're getting about 140. Now that we just bent it harder, so we're gonna see if it works any better. And he also added a little more uh, ballast or counterweight. I think Bullseye took the ball. Bullseye. Bullseye! <laughs> I don't think he did. Did we bring the ball back? No, we didn't take it with us. It must have been here. Oh, it's in here. Alright. Don't be blaming the guard dog. Alright, let me go down there and we'll check it the distance. Yeah, we got some pretty heavy rain here, or wind I mean. Alright, that was less, so that angle's too much. Fetch. Fetch. What, what does fetch mean to you? Fetch! Bullseye. Oh, I guess he don't want the ball. If it has feathers on it, it'll be different. Alright, we bent that pin back to the shape that gave us the longest distance before. Three. Yep. Three. Two. One. Oh, definitely! Wow, that really went! 
Yeah, so we got 167 feet out of that one by bending that pin back. And the ball ended up way down there, so he can run and get it all the way for it. Where the heck is that thing? There it is. Yeah. Alright, so we'll take that pin and try and bend it back a little bit more, maybe half of an inch, okay? Yes, and we'll sir. see what happens. Yes, uh, just so you guys know, we took a pin and drew a pattern of it on a, a paper over there at the shop. So we can always get back to the original mark that we were. Uh, we're trying. That was a good one. Yeah, it was. Okay, so actually we had it marked on a piece of wood. So hold it on there better. Yeah, you can see that is the one that gave us the most amount so far. So what we're going to do is when we bend it this way, okay, we came out here as much as two inches. It was less. One inch was still less. So we're going to try going that way a little bit, maybe a half inch or so to see what happens. Okay, that one there, 135. I think we should test it more because the wind was blowing pretty hard there. Right. Do it again. Yeah. All right, so we put a bucket here. We're, we're, we're done going for distance. Now we're going for accuracy. We're hoping to hit the bucket. Go ahead. We got the distance down right. Fetch! We got the distance. Fetch! Bullseye, go get that ball. Get the ball. Go get the ball. What's wrong with you? Now Bullseye's up there taking the ball away from the pouch. There! Come on. Come here. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Wow. That was a good one. That overthrew the bucket, but it wasn't too far about line. 155. <laughs> Stay here. Stay. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Wait. Bullseye, come here. Three, two, one. I don't think it was in the pouch right. Alright, well that stick don't work, so... Oh, oh, it almost hit the bucket. Oh man, that at the end of the tape there. Finally, you're doing your job. Take it over to Carmine. It went 200 feet with rolling, but that thing was really booking. You're here right next to the outside of the bucket, I think. We might have to look at the video better, but I'm pretty sure it hit like right here. <sighs> That's insane. I hit about four feet, but it was dead on for right in front of the bucket. It hit like right here, but and the, oh man, oh boy. Three, two, one. All right, so it bounced about right over here, and it went rolling. Right here is 146 feet. 
so we'll see where it goes next. Yeah! Two, one. Yay!